You can open the FBA Inbound Shipment Creation Wizard via the Morphing Search, as shown here, or alternatively, from the Inventory section of the menu. The wizard allows for the flexible configuration of all aspects of your FBA Inbound Shipment, including an interim warehouse that's used to track inventory in transit. When you're ready to add products, you can move to the next step. Click on Add Products to start, and then search for Amazon Fulfilled Product SKUs. SKUs must be valid for FBA and have available inventory in the selected warehouse. Select the product to ship so you can add it onto your shipment. Notice the shipment's new saved status after you add your product. After you enter the quantity, you're ready to move to the next part, the prep guidance. Here's where you view Amazon's instructions to prepare your products, including the label and package and wrapping requirements. Now you can ask Amazon to preview your shipment. The wizard will fetch all the setup details right from Amazon and give your shipment a previewed status. You'll see the fulfillment location, the shipment IDs and package name, and the party who'll label the items. You can always expand the shipment ID to double check on the item details. You have 48 hours to confirm a previewed shipment before giving it a working status. This will tell Amazon that you're going ahead with the shipment. Note that if Amazon ever splits your shipment up into separate packages, you can easily set them all to a working status in bulk by clicking here. The next step is the packaging. For small parcel shipments, you choose small parcel as the shipment type. It's super easy to drag and drop items into their boxes. And then enter the quantity to transfer and apply. You can update the box details whenever needed. The weight will auto-load based on the product properties in Seller Cloud, as will the box dimensions for single items based on the product's dimensions. Save any new details and proceed with the last step, the shipping. Open the shipping method and choose non-partnered to use your own carrier. Select the one that you want and the type of service. Seller Cloud will now generate a carrier label for you to print out when ready. Generating the label in Seller Cloud will distribute the total label cost among all ship units for highly accurate product cost reporting. Amazon will then issue a tracking number to submit for your package. Go ahead and submit that tracking info to Amazon. Note that Amazon will issue separate tracking numbers if shipping multiple packages. Printing your carrier and FBA package labels is as easy as one, two, three. Whenever you're ready, you can mark your package as shipped on Amazon. This automatically moves your shipped item from your default warehouse into Seller Cloud's interim warehouse, where it will stay until it's received by Amazon's fulfillment center, and then will be seamlessly moved into the FBA warehouse, where it is now ready for orders.